I was walking somewhere once and all of a sudden there was a mountain in front of me. Now at first glance this mountain appeared to be bigger than it was. You know? And as I got closer, it even looked bigger and bigger than it was, guys. So I said to this mountain, mountain, I command you in the name of the seas, move. It's still nothing. Okay. I command you in the name of the stars, move. It's still nothing, guys. My chosen ones, when you speak to your mountain and your mountain is not moving, it means two things, guys. First, it means that you're not strong enough to cross this mountain. And B, it means that you're speaking to the, this mountain in a, in a language that this mountain doesn't understand. <laughs> you know? It's like you speak in English and the mountain only understands Chinese. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Guys, it, won't, it wasn't until I turned the my attention within and i said to this mountain mountain i command you in the name of the living father that is within me move and i could see this mountain trembling guys as this mountain was trembling i walked close to this mountain i picked up a shovel and i started digging you know what i mean and the more i'm digging guys the more i'm seeing that this mountain is giving way. You know what I'm saying? What is your mountain this morning, my chosen one? Is it your job? Is it your wife? Uh, I mean, is it your marriage? <laughs> is it your business? You know? How to speak to your mountain, my chosen one? Yeah. Hello, beautiful people of the world. This is Alula, and welcome to Awaken the Ego with it. Like this video and subscribe for more videos like this, guys. More chosen ones subscribing to this channel. Before I get any further in this video, let me just take this opportunity to thank all of you for subscribing and commenting, guys. My chosen ones, today I want to talk about how to speak to your mountain in a language that your mountain understands seriously speaking guys you know what i'm saying it's not the absence of the mountain you should be worried about it's your ability to cross this mountain guys after all this is the reason why you're here this is why you are necessary my chosen one you know what i'm saying you need to cross your mountain so that you can also show others how to cross it, guys. You understand what I'm saying? Since we are different, different, different people, guys, we have different, different mountains. And the bigger the mountain, the bigger the treasure that's beyond this mountain, guys. I know some of you are thinking, why me? Why have I been giving this challenge, guys? Guys, once you just cross this mountain, what's on the other side is, it will blow your mind. <laughs> really, really, really. You know what I'm saying? So how do you speak to your mountain, my chosen one? First thing first, you got to change the game. Let me explain to you what I mean. You see, when an ego is hunting for a snake, she picks it up and lifts it in the air. You see that? Now the ego lives in the sky and the snake lives on the ground. So when she picks it up, she changes the game. Because the snake is not used to the air, guys. He's good on the ground. Just like that ego, guys, you got to change the game from physical to spiritual. I'm talking about metaphysics, guys. I'm talking about beyond the body. Meaning that you cannot change matter with matter. You have to rise above the matter and then change it from a higher consciousness, guys. 
you basically have to live on the fifth dimension to deal with the problem this that is on the three dimensional now the reason why this mountain appears to be bigger than it is is because of the way you're looking at it guys you know what i'm saying dealing with a 3d problem with 3d solutions guys is a lose lose but this chosen one guy you've been given a power that is inside of you that is more bigger than anything guys this is why the society always encourage you to take your focus off within and put it without guys once you just take off your attention from within understand that you're already lost my chosen one your answer is within your power is within you know what i mean one of the quality of being chosen guys is that your ability to reign from inside now once you reign from inside guys you keep walking to this mountain you say to this mountain move and you're gonna see your mountain moving guys but you need to persevere in this feeling perseverance is the key guys some of you your mountain might take you a year to cross some of you might take you a couple of uh, three years five years and let me tell you the bigger you have to climb this mountain the easier the going down this mountain will be meaning that the more success that will that be waiting for you guys and also is the person you become in the process which is more important you know what i mean guys you need to take the attention of this world and put it on a spiritual world you see the world says to you guys uh let me give you and then you can be but the spirit say be and then you should be you shall have it all guys this is the difference now that you, the way of changing the game is basically is to look at the world in a different way guys that is how you throw this mountain of edge and then you can cross it because you have a power of living the living father within you guys you speak to your mountain with your emotions guys emotions are the most purest way to communicate let me tell you bruce lipson said language was created for deception you know what I'm saying? Words can decept you guys. You know? And words is nothing without being combined with feelings and emotions. Guys, emotions and feeling is how you communicate with every living thing there is. You understand what I'm saying? You can say to a mountain, move like a million times with the words. But if you haven't felt that feeling within you guys, that mo mountain will not move. You understand? What I'm this is the problem with religion, guys. The religion gives you systems <laughs> that make you think that will handle your mountain. But let me tell you now, it just disguises itself as the solution by name, boys. It really isn't because you are thinking that there's an outside entity to come and help you to get what you want or to cross this mountain but my chosen one all you gotta do is ask yourself why am i necessary if somebody or something is gonna come help me no guys the power is within you it's like you got everything within you now and then you're waiting for something else it's just not gonna happen guys and speaking to this mountain in a way in a language that it understands means speaking to it with your emotions meaning that to be this the thing before the thing is or to be one with the mountain guys if you just be one with the with the mountain with your thoughts with your feeling and then you begin to feel the experience and teaching your body you know chemically what the experience feels like before it is then now you have become one with this mountain now if you are one with this mountain 
There you go. The mountain will give way, guys. Becoming one with that thing is the way to make the thing not resist you, guys. This is the thing. And as a chosen one, as a human being, guys, we are one with everything that is. We are part of the same consciousness. You know what I'm saying? The same consciousness that is in you is also in other things. That's why I said, cut this stone and you can find me there. And you can climb this tree, I'm also there. You go in the deepest ocean, guys, I'm also there. You see what I'm saying? Becoming one with everything that is, is the way to speak to your mountain, my chosen one. My chosen one, you speak to your mountain by uh, building a momentum, guys. Now we talked about the spiritual side. Building the momentum is the physical side of things, guys. You know what I mean? Now part of being one with everything that is, is to direct all your emotions and also physically to go into the same direction. Now, since that you are a spiritual ready, uh, ready, and you are within, now it's time to get your physical body ready by building a momentum. Meaning that by building a routine, guys. Hello. Once you build a routine then you can get into that momentum you know what i mean it's like an, you got that engine going and you you know you, every day every day that you get up you can be that closer to closing this uh crossing this mountain guys don't think that everything happens very quickly some of you chosen ones want to cross this mountain overnight let me tell you now that's not possible even if it's possible, it's not good for you guys. You know what I'm saying? The more you stay in this feeling, physically, spiritually, and drive this feeling towards one goal, and be in this momentum, be in this mode, and the more you stay in this, the more this mountain will give way, guys, in my experience anyway. Man, you do these three things, guys. There's no mountain that will be in front of you that you cannot cross. Let me tell you something. But you have to reject the things of this world. Meaning that you have to take your attention off this world, guys. And turn it within. Things will appear to be bigger than they are. But don't forget you are bigger guys that was a few years ago i was with the certain woman and there was a mosquito in the room and as soon as this woman saw this mosquito she jumped and i said to, the, to her look how small the mosquito is and look how big you are <laughs> do you know what i'm saying guys i said that to say this that it doesn't matter how big the mountain appears to be that you're bigger guys this is what the world hides from you my chosen one that you are multi-dimensional beings which means that you have the ability to rise above this dimension and then go into your dimension where you're really from which is a higher dimension and then solve your problem from there otherwise it's like going head to head with this world things is a lose-lose guys this is why these low entities have designed this world the way it is. Is that you autom automatically lose when you go head to head with the way de they designed it because it's designed for failure. But then when you rise above this spiritually, guys, it's like you change the game. It's like, they, you know what I mean? Now they lose. And then you keep on going to your destination, guys. All right, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you. Like this video, guys. Subscribe to this channel. Until the next video, God bless you, and take care, guys. Bye-bye. See you. All right, guys. What is your mountain this morning? Uh, let me tell you now. You have the ability to cross this mountain. As long as you turn your attention 
within guys that is why this channel is called awaken the ego within there's an ego in everybody in every one of you guys uh you know all right guys take care bye bye